Hello, everybody. I've been having stream for a bit. Been having trouble with internet problems. It has been a, a nightmare these last these last 72 hours or more. This has been hell. So but I today, do what they pay me to do. That's it. Okay, you you, you you do you do that, boy. You do you do you do you. All right. But today we're back. We're gonna stream. We're pl playing Witcher 3 Wild Hunt at the moment. I'm just gonna pop out videos and see what's right now. Um, I just decided here later on I'm going to do Kingdom Hearts. I'm just trying to set everything fly set out here, which I'm having trouble with something. A second. There we go. Okay. All right. A lot of people were probably pissed how I have his hair. Well, I noticed when his hair is long, it's gripping through his armor, which is why I, I gave him the bangs. It, with my issues, it just bugs the hell out of me. Otherwise, I would not never change his hair. So. There's that. There's an explanation for that one. We're in, right now, Blood and Wine. I did play a lot on my own. So. Okay. I just Something hope we could hear. It's in the air. I can smell it. Yeah, of course you can. I just can't wait for the next Witcher game. What is done? And I, I just can't be with another Witcher than Carol, man. They're gonna do that. I'm sorry. I don't think I'll no. get it. Like, come on, man. You can't just put a very popular character and just shove him out the front door. I, that's a dumbass idea. But well, that's what we keep hearing. And it's just. It's just unacceptable. In case y'all don't know what the hell I'm talking about. Now, basically, a while ago back, there was announced some new Witcher game. School of the Cat, I believe, or something. And I don't know where it is in development. I really didn't care afterwards. After I knew Geralt was in the Prime Witcher, I was like, nah. I, I lost track of it. But if I had to guess, the game's probably in almost finished development. If I had to guess. Bastard! <laughs> Get off. Oh, you bastard! Come here! Die! Giant centipede spawning ground. Should destroy it. Whoop. Ooh, I got what I was looking for as well. Nice. I'll make a few of those. But, ever, as people know, I am pouring it to YouTube as well, because I did have a channel there and I gave up on one. That's why a little bit, that's why some videos are going, I'm talking a little bit as I can. So it's not just staying on Twitch. Okay. 
Now, why the hell am I walking? I keep forgetting. Hi, little roach. Ah, you look go, fabulous. Go. So what I did, I finished the game. And, uh, I did the, um, uh, Hearts of Stones DLC. And now we're in What's that about? Blood and Wine, now. Oh, shit. The dressings, bandages, where did I put them? Forget it. Bandages won't do him any good. What? Oh, but he breathed still a moment ago. Mm-hmm. Breathed his last, then. Bled to death. Legs broken. Femoral arteries ruptured. Wound like that, you're dead in minutes. Gods. What happened here, exactly? I... I was rolling through, fully loaded, when I heard screams. This one crawled towards the road, then drooped to the ground, lost consciousness. I jumped down to help him, dress his wounds. Then you appeared. Pretty admirable stopping to help a stranger. Truthfully, when I saw him, I considered it might be an ambush. The thought entered my mind, I near decided to crack the whip. But to abandon a man in need? It's simply not the decent thing to do. Decent enough in many other places, believe me. Before you go on, clean your hands thoroughly and burn your shirt. I'd also want to rub some time on your body to be sure. The smell of blood might attract ghouls otherwise. Who? Who might you be, precisely? A witcher. Oh. Uh, 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 do, do, do you expect some beast might have killed him? See what we have here. Legs broken, but cause of death's the wound. Small but deep, edges unfrayed. Either a thrust weapon or a thick claw. Maybe a wyvern's. Tough to say, and... Mm, breastplate's unusual. Dented. And it's got a patina. An antiquity, I believe. I deal in these things, so... Uh, what's puzzling is... Why did he done it? Not likely to learn that from him. Now to figure out where he came from. From that house, I'm assuming, but need to investigate. Got some work to do. So... So long. Wait, I will come with you. Hmm, so be it. But stay close, keep it down, and don't touch a thing. Trail leads to the house on the hill, which stands silent as a grave. been here he broke his legs fell while climbing over the wall trying to leave the property probably after he didn't manage to open the gate gates locked from the inside he'd been jostled though something tried to get out damn it good gods what the hell's this setting for a banquet it seems so what's your suspicion did none survive gods silver tableware Often engravings. Servant. Stabbed to death. Over a dozen blows with a sharp object. Some post-mortem. I cannot believe this is the work of a man. It was a monster, to be sure. Torso punctured with great force. Blow pierced hardened steel. Man on the high road. Breastplate was identical. Throats massacred. One mighty blow. Shield along sides old and dented. Swords ceremonial. And Shea handiwork clearly. Ceremonial bowls? For little sacrifices? Of what? Please, do not say humans. Burn marks. Something catch fire? Explode? Strong stench. 
multiple wounds on the body. All puncture wounds, but hard to tell what caused them. The victim's human, but the attire's elven. Are you certain? How did he come by it? We've so few non-humans in Tucson. Fled, then dropped to the ground to douse the flames. Didn't manage. Burnt smells growing fainter. Might have been another luckier soul managed to flee. Doublet scorched. Wriggled out of it, tossed it, then ran on. Yeah, I smell trouble. Perhaps there's no one inside of- I know you're in there. Breathing's loud and clear. Open up. <coughs> we mean you no harm. Listen, I'm a witcher. I'm here to help you. But if that's gonna happen, you gotta answer some questions first. Who are you exactly? The Durant Fosher Plamonton de Sefferman of the Society of Friends of the History of Tutor. We meet here annually to mark the anniversary of the Elfin Homage. But something like this... Why, it's a first. You mentioned them. Who do you mean? Those... I, I don't know what they were. Spirits... It all occurred to of a sudden. We were staging a scene. The, the, the death of being homage. There was a flash of light that blinded me completely. I heard cries, though saw nothing. Then felt my own robes were in flames. I broke and ran, threw off my doublet, leapt in here, and it shut and locked the door behind me. They pounded on the door. I, I, I thought they would get through. I, I thought I was done for, but, but in the end, it, uh, it could come. Hmm. So while reenacting a scene from the past, somehow, unintentionally, you summoned a specter, a Korgorath, or a tube, maybe. What? What now? Best thing? You gotta do it again, of course. Are you mad? Would you have this thing kill us? No, don't want it to kill anyone. Precisely why I gotta do my job. Summon it again, whatever it is, and tend to it once and for all. Durand, think I can reenact the pledge? The giving of homage, alone? It was a great, momentous event. The surrender of Tucson's last elf and king. You will need at least three individuals. You know what I'm gonna ask for? Need your help. But I'll understand if you turn me down. No objections? Good. Let's get to work. Start by clearing the corpses. Got some time. Won't start the reenactment before nightfall. Things of this sort are a lot more likely to work after dusk. One last thing, though. My pay. Don't work for free, you know. Understood. Just keep the danger at bay, and I shall be generous. Through and through. I will stand, or rather, sit in for King Ludovic, upon the Elfin Throne, while you, Witcher, will play the Enshe Ruler, who we must... The Vethef, the Elfin King, hosted Ludovic in his own palace upon his own throne, amidst the blinding glow of a plethora of torches. Damn it. Don't interrupt. 
laid at Lutovic's feet a loaf of linen and elfin bread, thus granting humans rule over seat yielding lands. He met that filled the at long last. The elfin king grasped his sword and shield, thus symbolically passing command of his armies to humans. in his pride, threw his blade, and dropped Lutovic, then spake. I accept your allegiance, and shall return in one year's time to... Ah! Look! Look! The statues! Impossible! God's mother! Need a strong potion. That come here, you bastard. Need full power. Okay, um, I think the mage is first. Right, she's down. Alright, she's down. Alright, the mages are down. Bring it! Come on! The sculptures, they came alive. By what witchcraft? Dunno. Specialize in killing monsters. Reviving them, not so much. I... I may know what happened. The statues, you see, once stood in the palace of one Defethov. I acquired them a month past because... Uh, Perhaps I should start at the beginning. This Devethev was to pay tribute to humans, producing statues of this sort each year. <gasps> Yet he did so but once, for he perished in the massacre of non-humans at the foot of Mount Gorgon in the year 782. It's fortunate he did to homage. Columns that would have turned the king and his bodyguards into so much colorful confetti. Typical treachery embodied elves. Pshit. You're no better. Elves were just defending their territory. You humans took it, but you still weren't sated. Had to cut the elves down every last one. You? What does that mean? You're a man as we are. Yeah, in a way. Just a shame to have to admit it sometimes. Your words? They're wrong, Witcher. But I'll not let you leave empty-handed. Take this for your reward. Farewell.
Okay. Money, money, money. Fuck the hostiles. I get is a blessing. Okay, what's up? There's another cave over here. Which I'm gonna hit real quick. Going to be very careful in my armor. It's shielded. Rock. The bodies 
Seems they were running for the exit. Traffic. Lock. Fire. God damn it, I hate when it does that. What the show me what you got. Good try, but no. Satchel looks like it belonged to a witcher. Faster. Someone to stop him. Hey, I take him from the 
What do you... Show. Sure.
Gotta go. So long. Gotta go. That's it, Roach.
You save my life. I thank you. Should you need something, find me at the cockatrice.
Run, Roach. Descriptions in elder speech. Damn. Salvation lies in our journals long gone, but in our hearts. Guess somebody else found out about it too. Elder, I should look around, see if I can find something else. Footprints, narrow and shallow. Somebody small, light. Woman, maybe. Wonder where they lead. Damn it! Trail breaks off. Wonder if the grave robber learned more than I did. Professor certainly can't do much to help me with my search. Hmm, won't learn anything else here. Map Triss sent me will have to do. Also, Epitaph mentioned both Ellerin and Dolnevde, Valley of the Nine.
Site marked on the map's all wet now. Sonra Tour flows through there. Must be where the Valley of the Valley once lay. Need to explore the location. Alright guys, I'm gonna leave this episode here. Just for now, uh, someone came up. They're having an affair, what's going on? Have a good day, everybody.